What's going on guys, Mr. Wheels here bringing you yet another episode of Sports Talk and the second episode tonight. Uh, what I want to talk about now is the, Maple the Toronto Maple Leafs and their goaltending situation for the upcoming 2013-2014 season. Now, uh, it was just, I guess, the end of last week when I was um, just surfing the web and I'm already, I was already hearing um, stories about a goaltending controversy in Toronto with uh, James Reimer and the newly acquired off-season acquisition of uh, Justin Bernier. Now, let me just start out by saying that, you know, controversy can be a good thing, but I think it's a little bit too early to say that uh, there's really a goaltending controversy when we're not even in uh, training camp yet. And I think, again, like I say in most of my videos, that's the media looking for a story. They're kind of lazy, I think, with this one. And I'm going to go over, um, you know, what probably should happen for the Leafs, um, at least in the early part of the season. So, um, like I said, they, they have picked up Justin Bernier uh, primarily as a backup um, uh, previously in this offseason. But... I really think that um, James Reimer is going to be the number one goalie, and and here's why. He's coming off his best uh, statistical season, and he's a lot better than what the media and uh, what a lot of people say about him. I don't think he's given near as enough cr credit as, he's, as he should be given, and I just want to go over some of his numbers and, and stuff just to... Um, let people know that you know he's better than what a lot of people say. First of all, um, he had nine, he went 19 and 8 last season. Um, actually, 19, 8 and 5, 5 being five overtime losses. Um, but for those hockey fans out there, you'll note that even an overtime loss means um, a point and. You know, with a record of um, primarily 19 and 8, he he also had uh, he added to that a uh, nine to four goals against average, um, and had four of his 10 career shutouts just last season alone. And let's not forget that Reimer, James Reimer, is the reason why the Leafs had a seven-game series with Boston. It definitely was not their defense. You know, you can't credit Dion Phaneuf with the reason why the Leafs made it a seven-game series with Boston. If anything, Dion Phaneuf is the reason um, why James Reimer had to bail the Leafs out so many times. And, you know, let's talk about Bernier for a minute. He's coming in, uh, kind of really didn't work out to be the best goalie um, that L.A. thought he was going to be. I think, they, I think L.A. thought he was going to be a bona fide number one goalie, and, and you know, the media is kind of doing the opposite thing with, with Bernie, and they're saying, you know, he's still um, working into his prime and, and all that, but so is Robert. These guys are both 25 years old, and and don't get me wrong, I'm, for Bernie, a 9-3 record as a backup is, is good, um, and, you know, he's going to push Reimer. Um, in a positive way to, to be better, but I, I think he's a little bit overhyped, um, Bernier is, and I think that, you know, Reimer's been the Leafs goalie for three years. He's, um, you know, the, the Leafs uh, got Reimer after having some uh, turbulent times with goalies, you know, um, guys like Vesa Toskula and um, J.S. Jaguar, and, you know, some other guys that really weren't, um, really shouldn't have been there in Toronto for as long as they were. So, you know, Reimer being a number one gives us some, some stability. He's going to, you know, he's got the potential to save, um, you know, 35 to 40 shots a night. And, you know, hopefully with the new additions to the Leafs, they can, the Leafs, they can pull out a, uh, a win even when Reimer you know makes 
30 plus saves. So I just want to, again, say, you know, don't believe everything the media says, and it is way too early for a goaltending controversy. My pick is Reimer will be the num the undisputed number one goalie coming out of training camp, and it'll be the preseason, the four games in the preseason that they should that both goalies should split, and then we'll see who the better goalie is, or they should at least both play in the preseason, and you know they don't have to split the four games. It could be three for one, Reimer, one for Bernier. If Reimer loses two out of the three, then maybe go with Bernier is all I'm saying. But um, really, going into training camp, it's a little bit early to, to really start to speculate. So, um, like always, guys, slap the like button, subscribe, tell me what you think, uh, you know, and if there's uh, topics you want me to talk about, um, put them in the comments below. See you later.